Good morning, good morning. Welcome to Fly Chick TV. It is currently 7. Y'all see that? Wait. Damn. 724. I'm drinking two different teas. One here. And I got my coffee. I am doing a makeup beat today because I'm like, I'm tired of looking rough at work. All right, you guys. I didn't even realize I was still recording with all that. I'm going to cut all that out. But your girl just got out the shower. Put it on some deodorant. I need to shave my armpits, but we ain't going to talk about that because I need to go get my maintenance done ASAP. Y'all know the drill. Edges on check. So while I'm doing my edges, I'm going to just give y'all a little talk through about um, some of the stuff that I've been up to. So basically, I've been grinding y'all, like seriously just putting in that work because there's a lot of things that I need. Oh, before I even get into it, don't forget to cop Remedy by Ari. Y'all see the drill. Let me set my thing in the middle. Y'all better catch y'all some Ari, some Remedy by Ari. Go and cop this lip mask. I got some on my lips for now. Just to, you know, spice up my lips. Make my lips good and ready for my lip glosses. So I'm just basically putting my hair up. My hair didn't completely dry and I have places to be. So I'm actually going to go to my other hairdresser for her to just do a quick set. Not a set. I hope she don't cut all my hair off because she loved doing that. But I'm just basically... Putting my hair in the ponytail right now, so I can um, do my hair. But yeah, y'all, like I was saying, I'm basically just like <laughs> busy with this externship. Like it literally takes over my whole entire day. Like seriously, it's really kind of annoying, but it's whatever. Okay, it's basically whatever at this point because I have two more weeks. Y'all see my new nose ring? I got a one that has like a screw on it. So yeah, girl been feeling herself a little bit. I just put it in at like six this morning. When I tell y'all the struggle is real trying to get that in my nose, like seriously, just a freaking struggle. It was a freaking struggle. It was a freaking struggle because the way that piercing is like, I had to open one of my piercings like I had to open one of my nose rings, make the hook straight, just to put this one in my nose. And I'm like, I need to change my nose piercing because these, the ones that I've been using have been very much like super, super, um, super, super like, they're not giving what it's supposed to give. Like they're cute, but they don't stay in my nose. They be falling out. So I ended up buying one that is more like a, that's more like a um, a hook, not a hook. Like you can you can uh, just screw it in, basically. Like screw it in to where like it looks better, and it stays in your nose. So like the hook basically goes in the metal piece. The metal piece that holds the piercing goes inside your nose first, and then you screw on the uh, then you screw on. My edges are grown, baby. Healthiness and just being negative free. So that's a blessing. But anyway, y'all, so basically, I got a new nose ring in my nose and I love it and I'm not taking it out for a minute because it's very easy to use. So, damn, my edges don't ever want to cooperate. Use this up, let's see. Mm -hmm, there we go. I be making ghetto edges because my edges be cute like that. Be giving me, be giving me that girl. As y'all can see, one side of my edges is a little shorter than the other. But we ain't gonna talk about that because your girl trying to just grow her hair, be natural. I'm not trying to be natural, y'all, but I'm just basically doing whatever to my hair. So my edges are done. I'm about to lay them with my band. Um, but back to the subject of hand. Yeah, I've been so busy with externship literally from morning to time. Like I said, it's currently 7.56. So 
So normally I get up around seven ish, maybe six. Sometimes I wake up at six, sometimes I wake up at seven. It honestly just depends on me for real. But because I've been trying to get up a little early to start my day, like today, I was like, I'm not gonna sleep all night. I'm not gonna sleep till 8 p.m. Then start rushing to get to externship. I'm actually gonna sit down, talk to y'all. I'm gonna sit down, talk to you guys, and you know, get my day started. Like, why not? So, I'm using my Cureology. I'm gonna do an updated skincare routine. I'm actually planning to buy. A new skincare routine not by a new skincare routine I'm gonna incorporate all two I have my old one is in my bathroom and it's just a new one that they sent me but I'm actually about to stop my Cureology um I actually canceled my subscription this is my last month so this one I'm gonna use very diligently basically I'm not gonna overuse it because I want it to last me like three months because Cureology is expensive and I don't got that type of money right now so I just want to kind of, you know, do what I got to do. So I'm about to just go ahead and prime my face while I got the chance. I'm about to prime my face up or whatever. And we finna get this makeup done. So yeah, basically y'all, like like I was saying, um, I like to just pat it into my skin instead of just rubbing it in. I like to just, it's quicker like that. Oh, there's something on my face. Y'all see my skin is getting better. But anyway, yeah, so basically, like, externship has really been taking up my time, bro. Like, it be days, like, I ain't even gonna lie. I was planning to film. I ended up doing a batch content shooting for this month because, like, every time I wanted to sit down and film something, I had to go do something else. So, like, I literally just, like, did two videos in one day, basically, for y'all. Actually, I did three videos. I chopped one down into two, and then I did another video for the Black History Month. Go check that out, because it is out now. And I basically just did that, because I was like, you know what, if I don't push myself and film something, you guys will not get a video. Because I was literally so tired last weekend, and I'm like, I seriously need to film something, because it's not that easy to film. Like, it's, not, it's easy to film, y'all, but it's hard when you got to do other stuff outside of that. And then you got to figure out what you're going to like shoot. So before I get into anything, before I get into my brows, I'm going to show y'all what I'm using these days. I did buy a sample of Mario's makeup, makeup by Mario, because I wanted to see how it looked. And I loved how it made my skin just look glowy and just skin like. And I wanted it to match my neck. I realized a lot of times the foundations that I get do not match my neck. And I know People be like, oh, you don't have... I personally was not doing that for a very long time when I started makeup. My makeup never matched my neck, but I said, no, ma'am. Not in 2023. We actually going to match our neck. So I got a darker foundation. But once I conceal and everything like that, you guys, chef's kiss. Like, I love makeup by Mario. This I'm going to actually tag him in this video. I am using his foundation in the color N24N. I don't know if y'all can see that. 24N. So I'll be using this foundation shortly. I don't need this, so you can toss that to the side, but I will be using the box for my makeup. All right, y'all, so that is the foundation I'm using for anybody who's wondering. So back to what I was saying, like, it was very hard for me these past couple weeks to film something, and I got kind of stuck on what do you guys want to see, because I filmed so, much, so many different things, and I didn't want it to come off like, oh, I'm always in my house, like I'm never going anywhere, which is kind of true. I am a homebody now. I used to go out a lot, but now I just kind of stay in my house. Not because I can't go anywhere. It's just I didn't feel like I don't really like going out too much. If I'm going to go out to eat, that's cool. But I am not going to waste my time to go out and not do anything productive. So I'd rather just stay home. And that's why a lot of my videos from start have been at home because I'm always home by choice so this year i plan on doing a lot more outing videos like going out you know to shop going groceries going to starbucks you know just little simple stuff so it's not just me in my house every day because that gets a little repetitive and i know y'all want to see more vlogs and more um get ready with me to go places so this year crossing fingers you know i get my, i'm working on my car y'all that's one of the reasons why I have not been able to go out as much because 
I'm just now getting my car fixed. My first car ever. I know that's crazy, right? My first car ever. So I'm getting that fixed. And it's just been a little patiently waiting. It's been a little frustrating, but it's almost ready. So once your girl get her car, y'all, I'm gonna be I'm gonna definitely make sure I do some food reviews. Um not overeating reviews, but I'm gonna get different food items and try to taste them and see what I think about them. But I ain't gonna break my my bank for no food. I'm gonna do what I can. I'm gonna do what I can. All right, y'all. So basically, like I was saying, it's just been a little frustrating because obviously I don't have my car right now, and my car is the main reason why I'm always I'm literally always filming in the house. And then again, like I said and stated, I am a homebody. I like to be home. But some days it, got, it does get boring, but at the same time, I love being home because I just feel safe when I'm at home. Not saying I don't feel safe when I'm outside, but it's just a comforting to know that I'm home and relaxed. But I'm going to get better, y'all. And I'm actually coming out with a gym vlog. I'm going to take you guys on a gym for the next month and a half because I kind of shoot my content depending on what I'm doing in the month because I don't want to film everything at once and then be like, oh, I don't have any content that month. You know what I'm saying? So... I like to just spread my content out because I feel like that's a better thing to do. But yeah, like I said, externship is going very well. I got two more weeks left. Thankfully, I've landed a position for a new job that I will be starting in the beginning of next month. So that job is going to take some of my time, but I'm only working. I'll have about four days off every week, so there's no excuse to vlog and I'm not allowed to vlog at work I keep telling y'all that because it's a real thing it's a HIPAA violation you don't need your patients business everywhere so I have to make sure that oh yeah let me show y'all I did wash my brushes like I told y'all these are washed and clean as y'all can see I'm letting them dry in the back um, so basically you guys like I was saying um, yeah, I can't be filming for y'all in my in my at my job. It's just not allowed. So because it's not allowed, because it's not allowed, I be trying to just film stuff outside of my job. Just so I don't get bored. And honestly, being a medical assistant, there's not really much we're doing. If I'm being honest, like we just take vitals, check blood pressure, you know, the little basic stuff. I mean, every job is different. But mostly we do shots like vaccinations, not vaccination. We can do COVID shots too, but I haven't gotten to that point. I did get checked off for um, subcut and interdermal for all my MA students. Y'all know what I'm talking about. And um, basically like that's really what all we're doing and just making sure the patient is cared for. You feel me? It's very important. So. That's basically my job at the moment. Like I told y'all, I'm going literally back to school in May of this year, right after my birthday. So I'm taking a couple trips before I start school again because, um, you know, when you start school, you gotta stay focused. You gotta be, you know, you gotta be on your A game. And thankfully, the school that I'm actually going to in May is online. So that's gonna give me a little bit more time and a little bit more like, leeway to film videos for you guys so i'll be doing my work like roughly in the morning times if i have class in the morning i log in check my classes do my homework read listen to my lecture and i'm good for the rest of the week like that's basically what i'm gonna be doing y'all so y'all gonna love it though because i'm gonna have time for you guys so i'm gonna have time for you guys to film more videos and yeah, we trying to get to 50 videos. I really, I think I'm already at 50 videos with my shorts, but I'm trying to get at least 65 videos or more by the end of this year. And mind you, I have a couple trips coming up at the end of the year. Just one, really. My favorite place to go is Ghana. So y'all gonna see a Ghana vlog very soon. But I'm going at the end of the year, so give me 10 months. Give me nine months and I'll be there. But anyway, y'all, um, I just want to say, like, I love y'all for supporting my channel. Like, everybody who's been tuning in to what I'm posting, like, definitely appreciating that. And y'all don't be scared to tell me what y'all want to see. Like, I will literally, I don't even care if it's just one person who wants to see a makeup tutorial. Like, I will dead, I would dead, leak. like, I wouldn't say dead, but I would for real, um, 
just do one video for somebody. So like I said, if you want to see some videos of me doing makeup again, like y'all tell me what y'all like. Because I really base it off of my analytics and what people are watching the most on my channel. So for me, like if y'all want to see something and you just want, like you literally could just message me on on uh, YouTube and be like, hey girl, I want to see you do this. I want to see, and I will do it. Like I don't even care if it's one person asking. Like I will do that for y'all. That's just the type of content creator I am. I don't need to have a thousand um, suggestions. It could just be one suggestion. You want to see it, I'll film it. You feel me? So don't be scared to get in my comments and just tell me what y'all want to see because I'm open to anything really. Um, for real, for real. I'm not, I'm me personally. I was just talking to my good sis about this, about these shower routines, like how y'all, you know, some people be, uh, you know, in the shower and everything. I just don't want to do that. But if you want like a morning routine, like how I'm chit chatting with y'all while I get ready for work, you're more than welcome to just hit me up like, hey girl, I wanted to see this and I want to see how you do this. All right, y'all. So it's open for real. Like, no lie. What time is it? I'm over here chit chatting my head off. Okay, it's only 8.04. Let me set a timer. For t let me do... Let me do about 25 minutes. I should... No, let me do 27 minutes. So I got a timer on and I'm actually about to play some jazz. Well, I don't need to play jazz. I'm gonna just talk. Okay, we just talking, okay? Talking to my subscribers. I love y'all. And don't forget to share my content, you guys. Like, seriously, share my content. If you like what y'all see, share my content. Like y'all see, I'm trying to film for y'all. I'm trying to talk to my people, you feel me? I want you guys to feel comfortable on my channel. This is a safe place. And I do have a testimonial video coming out to continue my mental health uh, journey, you guys. And I kind of give you guys a background on why I want to talk about mental health and why it's such a soft spot for me. I'm going to open up with you guys, like... I'm going to be open with you guys. Like I said, I'm not the type of content creator where I'm about to be sharing my personal life. Like my relationships and all that. We ain't doing that. This is a business. We are focused on bringing awareness to mental health and things of that nature. Things to help people. I don't want to be known for sharing my business. No. We're going to talk about mental health. We're going to get down to the nitty gritty. But we still going to, you know... We still gonna do what we gotta do. Cause, yes, ma'am. I like to kind of shake my foundation before I use it. Cause sometimes it be a little. Mm, it be a little. Ugh. But y'all, like I said, so I'm not gonna be the type to be sharing all my personal business on here. The most y'all gonna get for real is mental health stuff. Um, That's the most personal I probably would get. So I did about a couple pumps of this. So I don't have to use too much. Oh, wait, let me make sure it's not opening. Okay. Yeah, that's cool. It's closed. Alright, so like I said, y'all, y'all gonna get a little bit of tea, a little bit of jizz, a little bit of mm -mm -mm. I kind of want to spot correct a little bit before I put this foundation on because I got a couple little pimples on my face that I ain't liking. I need to cover that up. I don't want to cover up my moles, but... I got a little bit of pimples around my skin. It's like, a, I don't know if it's heat rash because I'll be turning on my heater, y'all, but I just kind of want to conceal a little bit. I don't usually do this, but I feel like I got a couple of pimples on my face that I want to cover up. So that's what makeup is for. <laughs> All right, y'all. So basically, like I was saying, I'm really just trying to uh, get some content in for y'all, even if I'm just talking to y'all. I know y'all like my talking videos, so I see y'all be commenting and stuff, so definitely appreciate that. But yeah, like I said, it's going to be mental health. It's going to be one of my main points in my videos. Like, I will have a segment for that. It's not just going to be a one-time thing. It will be an overall thing because, like I said, I will be doing a mental health clinic in Ghana. So that's this is the start of it. While I'm in school, I'm going to talk about what I learned in school as a health care management student. Like, I'm going to put y'all on game, like, about the healthcare. You feel me? I'm still going to be a content creator. I'm not letting go of my other dreams, like, you know, starting my fashion design line and my high couture fashion. That's later down the road. This is my plan 
to, you know, do something first, you know, you got to start somewhere. So, y'all, um, like I said, I am literally just, you know, making it do what it do because you got to have many plans in this life. Many. You can't just stick to one income. You can't stick to one thing. You got to do it all. I wouldn't say do it all in a bad way, but do it all in the sense of you got to just do what you gotta do like period like i said so y'all i will be um i love this foundation mario thank you for giving us women some real foundation that actually looks good on our skin and looks skin like literally like chef's kiss okay and i'm using the excess powder right here not powder uh, i really should have just warmed up my face a little bit i do have a spray do have a spray that I'm about to use to, oh, here it okay. this is what I was looking for y'all my uh, makeup mist satin mist so my foundation can actually melt into my skin but like the brush was too dry so I'm just kind of you know making it do what it do I just felt like getting cute today I'm just kind of tired of looking ratchet not ratchet I just haven't been putting in no effort into my outfits nothing like I ain't been trying to look cute and I'm like, nah, you an influencer, baby. You gotta be on point at all times. So, I am an influencer slash businesswoman. So, what is this? I have a mole on my face and I didn't realize that. I was like, what is that freaking thing? I wanna kinda carve down my eyebrows, y'all. So, yeah. So, I'm pretty much, my camera wants to die. So. I have done my face, as y'all can see, my face is done, and now that my face is done, I have to fix that. I need to conceal whatever, what time is it, where's my watch? Matter of fact, I need to put this on. So this is just an update and a chit chat, get ready me, with me for work, and um, yeah, so let me hurry up y'all, because I gotta get going in this, I don't need my mom screaming at me because I'm taking too long to get you know, ready for work or whatever. So I'm just doing a nice beat. You no, know, something quick and easy. I'm about, I'm pretty much done with my face, y'all. I'm just doing the necessary steps for my foundation. I'm just now starting to put foundation on my skin. Like, not on my skin. What am I saying? I'm rushing, so I'm like jibber jabbering. I'm basically you know doing everything together today because i want everything to be seamless and i like a light highlight face because my foundation is a little is darker than my normal color that i use so i kind of like to um i like to warm up my concealer which is the la girl i never took the wrapper off of here wow we like film on my phone which i'm not mad about my camera is good on my phone but i like that extra hd quality on my actual phone like i mean on my camera that's why i bought the camera to have a good quality but this battery life is just stressful like it's annoying i'm gonna have to look and see if they got like a replacement battery or my battery is just weak i don't know but i need to look into that because girl why are you so annoying like you always dying on me like what is that why are you dying on me because why yeah so y'all i'm just you know getting my face ready like i said um i feel like i'm missing something but i'm not i'm gonna use a little bit of this as my um i'm gonna use a little bit of my bronzer for my lid before i put on my lashes or whatever i kind of just want to give myself a neutral you know, neutral, um, and I'm actually just gonna blend my contour while I'm doing this. Blend my contour. Really, this is why I don't like putting concealer where it needs to go. That should be moving. That shit is annoying. All right, y'all, so I've done my contour and I feel like I need to highlight the middle of my nose so everything can just be seamless, like I said. All right, what am I looking for? What am I trying to grab? Oh yeah, my highlighting. 
I want to highlight my nose a little bit. And I'm letting this uh, concealer dry down because I've realized when it doesn't dry down long enough, yo, it be moving everywhere. And I don't like that. So I'm just letting this dry down real quick. I'm just going to fan it. And now we're going to get into this blending. So yeah, you guys. So basically, like I said, it's kind of been hard, challenging to film for you guys. As much as I've been wanting to film, it's been a little challenging due to the fact that um, I have to go to work in the morning. Well, externship. Mind you, if you didn't know, when you finish your, ex your um, program at school for medical assistant, you do have to do a mandatory 180 hours. Well, at my school, 180 hours. And then the 180 hours that you're doing is going towards your graduation. So if you don't do those hours, you are not graduating, baby. Let me tell you that right now. You are not graduating. You are not graduating anything. So just make sure you keep that in mind when you want to be a medical assistant. You are not getting paid for these hours. You are literally just training for your real job, whatever job that might be. You might get hired on the site that you're at or you just look for something else. So that's the thing so yeah you guys i'm almost done just kind of blending in place my foundation or whatever i mean my concealer so yeah you guys that's basically all about ma it's a very easy program like i had no experience in medical assisting but i took the program and i did well i basically got like a two i think i got close to a three two point eight or something i don't know it's not the highest GPA, but for me to not know anything about medical stuff, I definitely get, I did that. I, I give myself props because it ain't too many people who can go through a medical assistant program and do decent. Because my first two classes, I definitely did horrible. But after that, I caught on real quick. I caught on real quick and got my things done. What is in my face? I'm trying to hurry up, y'all, because I'm literally rushing right now. I'm literally placing shit on my skin before setting my foundation. Not setting my foundation, but setting my concealer because I don't want to miss those steps. And then, oh, damn, I forgot to do this. All right, y'all. So let me go ahead and wrap this up. Where is my powder brush? As y'all can see how flawless my skin looks, go get this Mario bar. Yeah, get that. Cause baby, I'm finna be sitting, okay? Kinda use my brush to set everything in so it's not like dots on my face from whatever. Okay, y'all, so I'm pretty much done. I got to go. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Um, what am I looking for? I'm gonna do a little brush real quick. Hopefully, I got time, but doing a little bit of blush. I'm late, y'all. It's 8:32. I need to go. I need to get going, y'all, cause I'm late as fuck. I'm not late, but I just gotta get on the road. I'm like 30 minutes away from my actual job, so because I love y'all, I did my whole face for y'all. So love you guys. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Or whatever. And yeah, we out of here. Peace.